and welcome back. Um, I am just adding a little extra tutorial in here, um, episode 1.2, because I got very, very excited. Um, when I left you last, I went down to explore this little cavern. I didn't want to waste your your time while I... Oh, didn't mean to do that. Um, while I'm wandering around down there. So I went down. I'm going to show you. I made myself a little step. Um, I think I went this way first. I do look down. I put torches up everywhere so I can see where I'm going and... Oh, Let's fill these holes up. And also to try and stop monsters from spawning. Um, and I went... Where did I go? Which way did I go? Maybe it wasn't that way. It wasn't that way. I went this way. Ignore me. I came down here. It reminds me, need to put a torch down there. So you don't want monsters spawning. And then coming up to my little house. And I'll have steps coming down here. Um, so I came down here, where this little waterfall runs down. And I jumped over this way. And I went this way first, and I found, oh, I need some more light, I need some more light, it's a bit dark, I came up, up here, there's coal, and more coal, there's loads of little caverns everywhere. And up here, because that's a stop, it's a dead end. And there's another bit. It gets better, it gets better. Loads of stuff to explore in our little cavern. I was quite surprised I didn't come across anything nasty. You know, monsters, nothing. So I was very lucky. Um, but monsters can spawn in dark areas. So bearing in mind, as I said, this area does go up to our um, little den. We want to make it light so we don't get anything nasty spawning and coming up and greeting us when we're sleeping. Um, but I found iron, look, loads and loads of iron. I'll show you the other place where I found iron. Um, so we're going to grab this so that we can make some extra tools and everything to help us along our way. I want to make some shears as well so I can show you how to get some wool and we can make a little bed for ourselves, which I can explain later on. Um, so what I also did is went this way, down where this little waterfall is. And you can also, if you if you know where the waterfall's going and it's safe, you can sit in here look, and you get a ride. Whee! Go down with the waterfall. Hey! But you can get trapped in water, so be careful. If you you know, if it's quite deep, it can take you a while to get up. So look, more iron. So I hit lucky going down. We managed to find ourselves a little cavern. There are caverns dotted around Minecraft, so if you're lucky, you can get yourselves little caverns. Now I either want to put a light in here or fill it up. Um, Let's fill it up. I don't want to waste all the stone. I got ten iron already. Oh, a bit more because there's some there too. Um, so yeah, up here. More iron. Look. I was gonna say I struck gold, but I didn't quite strike gold. I strike gold even. I struck iron, which is better for us at the moment anyway. We like iron at this stage of the game. We want as much of it as possible. And look, this looks quite interesting. This little area. There might be more to that than meets the eye. I don't like holes. I fill the holes up. Now, what you could do when you when you start expanding mines and making little neat places, you can use places like this as a as a starter. And I'll show you in later tutorials how to create awesome mines and the quickest way to mine, so you can get resources. And you know you can use places like this as a base to start off your awesome new mines. Any more iron up there? No, no iron. Oh, okay, let's do that back up. Walk back and let's do the light back there. Don't want a monster spawning in that little area. And so I've got 25 iron ores. So that's not bad. It was quite a nice little cavern to find. I'm sure if I Carry on digging and exploring, I'd find more, but that'll be enough for now, so we're going to trot back up. Mm. If I can remember how I get out. It's up this way, isn't it? Yeah, there we go. And up, and over. And go back to my little spot. I could get some, um, how much coal have I got? How much coal? I've got 50. I probably need some more coal, really. Um. Let's go back. Where was the coal? Oh, I'm getting so lost. It's that little bit there that keeps confusing me. It was down here, wasn't it? It was down here, over here. Let's go get that coal. If you had just got it the first time, it would have saved so much time if I'd have got it 
that very, very first time when I went up and said, oh look, there's some coal. Yeah, that would have been a good time, Dracus, to then get the coal. Right, okay. So let's grab this. And as you see, we're using our iron pickaxe now, and it is much quicker at mining things. And the health lasts much, much longer. So we've been quite lucky, really, on our, our first little exploration. Because we've managed to find a nice little cavern, we've got some nice resources, and this is going to help us along our way as we explore out into the big bad world. There we go, it's a nice little coal. Any more? Any more? How many have we got now? 33, okay. Well, if we spot any on the way back, we'll grab it. Other than that, I'm quite happy with that. Quite happy. Let's trundle back. Let's trundle. We can make this into a nice little mine later. Whoop. Then up again, up again, up again. Way over the water. I need to go back up this way. Make a little step for myself just to make it a bit easier to get up. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, it's raining. Oh, it's not very nice weather out there, is it? Ew, that is. That is nasty. That is not nice. Lucky we're in here. Um, what I'm going to do, while it's raining and horrible out there, um, we can make ourselves, apart from the tools, let's make some. Um, let's put this in here. And that can make us some iron while we're waiting. And while I'm waiting for the iron to come up, we can make this a little bit nicer. What I'm going to do is make a door first. So we've got um, some wooden planks. We're going to open the crafting table and get the oak planks. And we're going to dot them about like so in that pattern. And that will give us a little wooden door. Pop that down there. Put that back there. And doors are good. Monsters can't get through doors. They can't open doors. So if you're behind a door, you are safe. But as I said, if you have got an area like this where you've got a little cavern down there you want to make sure that either you put a door there but better than that you really just need to have lots of lights and torches so that monsters won't spawn and come up and get you from the from the darkness don't like monsters they scare me what i might do though just to make it feel a bit more homely i might i might put a door a couple of doors oh we'll leave it for now okay so all we need to do is first make an opening so we're going to open that up like this Ew, that's not nice. It's been like that here today as well in the UK. It's been very, very rainy. Um, so we're going to select our door, point to the floor there, and click. And there we go, little door. Nice and safe. And you just click it. Right click. And it'll open. And close. When it's open, you can walk through it. And when it's closed, you can shut it. And as I said, monsters cannot open it. So you're nice and safe when you're behind that little door there. Um, how are we doing with this iron? It's coming along nicely. Um, and now that door's there, it makes us a bit safer, so we can um, open this area up a little bit. Why not? Let's get rid of this wall. Oh, didn't mean to do that one over there. And we'll have to put another torch or two up. Okay, get a bit, the ceiling a bit high. Headspace. Let's plug that back up. There we are, and then I'm going to put another torch up. Now, what I'm going to do is put a torch above the door like that so I can get rid of that. Don't want that one. Let's get rid of that. It's looking much more homely. Let's get rid of this here. And we'll do another torch. And we'll put a little torch. Two torches above our workstations, and then this goes down here to our mine. And what I might do, so I will, I'm going to come up here, um, and I'm going to... Hmm, let's change this. I'm going to get rid of this wall. Oh, look at that. I forgot about that stuff. Let's get rid of that. Got more coal there. Look. 
grab that while we can. And what I'm going to do is when that furnace is stopped, I'm going to move these down here. So if you want to, if you've got something like a crafting table, you want to move it. You just need to hit it like you would any other block, um, and then that will. Um, just, it won't destroy it, but it'll just make it into a little block so you can grab it and move it. We've got, that's only got four more to do, so we'll move that in a second. And then later on, if, you, know, you can make a little door there, you can do anything, but I mean, for now this is going to be a little mining area, so we'll keep it open. Let's put a little torch up here. If you're really picky, like I probably will be later, I don't like having different shades on my wall, so you can get rid of that. <laughs> we can sort that out later. Have a nice little... Have everything the same pattern. Everything made out of the same material. When is that rain going to give up? Come on, furnish. Right, okay, here we go. So we've got loads of iron now to get going. Um, I don't know why that's still, that's still burning there. That. Okay, we'll get rid of this now. Might be easier for you to pick up, it's be much quicker. There we go. Whee! And then get down here, grab that down there. And then we've got a little like workstation, a little work area there. It's very dark, isn't it? Why is it so dark there? Let's have another one there. There we go. So that's made better. We've got a nice big area. We've got um, a little area down to our little cavern. Uh, where we can do some mining, we've got a little crafting table, we've got a little furnace, um, and we have also got those material, iron, coal, etc. Um, and what I'm going to do before I finish this tutorial, before we get on to the, the next bit, um, I'm just going to make a couple more um, tools. Um, the first one I'm going to make um, is some shears. Now we use shears to get wool from sheep. Um, and I'll explain why we need that in the uh, next tutorial. And we take those shears, put them down there. Um, we'll also make uh, an iron axe, because we didn't manage to make one of those the other day. There we go, we can place that axe. Um, and what I'm also going to show you is... Um, I've got enough. Uh, I've got enough. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, okay. I was going to show you how to make a chest because um, our inventory is getting a little bit full. Uh, but I need to go out and get some um, wood first. So I'll leave that until the next tutorial because it is dark, dark and nasty. Um, so I'll leave that there. That is um, the end of the bonus tutorial 1.2 because I wanted to show you what I exciting stuff I found down that little cavern. And um, we will be back next time to continue our journey. Thank you very much. See you all later.